Psalm 512 For you bless the righteous, O Lord. You cover him with favor as with a shield. This is the time to be favored, but you can only access the favor of God. If you believe it, you see it, you receive it, you declare it before you can have it. Because what you don't say, you can't get. So, dear friend, if you do not speak it out, it can never happen in your life. If God never spoke out the word, let there be light, there will not have been light. So, if you believe that it is time to favor you, then you have to open your mouth and say what God says concerning your life. It doesn't matter where you are or where you are being born. God can take any situation and turn it around for your good. Number 6 verse 24 to 25 says, God's face will shine on you and cause you to stand out. My dear friend, you are doing well in life. Does not mean you are doing it on your own strength or on your own talents or your own connections. There's a great force breathing behind you, guiding you, protecting you and favoring you in all you do. This means you are going to be clothed with favor if you do all God wants you to do. God loves you so much, He wants to pour out His blessings on your life. He has amazing things in store for you. You were created for a life of victory, joy, and abundance. Have you ever felt a nudge from God? A feeling deep inside that He is guiding your steps? That is God's favor leading you to a brighter future. God's favor is like sunshine on a cloudy day. It brings warmth, hope, and new beginnings. You find strength when you are weak, courage when you are afraid, hope when you are in despair. How can you experience this amazing favor of God in your own life? It begins with a sincere and open heart, a life of holiness. It begins with honoring God with the whole of your heart. It begins with the relationship you have with God, building a strong personal connection with Him, the foundation of experiencing His favor. It begins with the great worship you pour out to Him each day. It begins your prayers to God, sharing your thoughts, your worries, and your gratitude before Him. It begins with the consciousness of your identity in Christ. Know who you are in Christ, when you put God first, His favor follows you all the days of your life. Be kind to others, just as God is kind to you. As you open your heart to receive more blessings, forgive those who hurt you. Hold no grudges, because it can block the flow of God's blessings in your life. Let go, and let God heal your heart. God's favor is not a one-time event. It is a journey of faith. It is a continuous experience that unfolds as we walk with Him daily. There may be challenges along the way, but remember that God is always with us in times of doubt and difficulties. When God favors a man, labor stops, struggle stops. If you are going through difficult times, don't be burdened. The God you have been calling on to will send forth His favor, His blessings, His healing and deliverance upon you. You are a recipient of God's favor. You may not know the words that God has spoken over your life. God has spoken great things over your life that will bring a drastic positive change into your life. You will soon come to the background and from that background to the forefront where people will see His great wonders in your life. You are surrounded by favor, God's favor. If you believe and trust in God, great things will begin to happen to you. Your dreams and aspiration will begin to get fulfilled. When God drops His favor on you, what seems difficult for others will become easy for you. What takes others a lifetime to get will be so easy for you to get because you are a recipient of God's favor. God has opened doors of favor for your life. Come to the beckoning of the Holy Spirit. Let the Holy Spirit direct you so that you won't miss out God's favor for your life. In Isaiah 119, God says, If you will only obey me, you will have plenty to eat. Dear friend, if you obey God, 
you are going to find yourself coming into the blessings and favor of God that you don't even understand because God has left some things behind just for you. The favor of God is already with you. Favor is a flavor of life. It changes your life around for good. It causes people to be good to you, even if they don't want to. It causes you to get things you did not deserve. It causes problems that looked permanent to suddenly turn around. You are the next in line for God's favor. The favor of God will locate you today and you will not struggle anymore. No matter how bleak things may look in the natural, remember, God is not tied to the natural. In his supernatural favor, he can take anything evil, turn it around, and make them favor you. Dear friend, God has plans for you and me. Big plans. Plans to prosper us and not to harm us. Even though it seems dark now, it is only for a moment because your future is bright and full of God's favor. Don't allow the challenges that come flooding in your life make you forget that God is always on your side. Don't be discouraged, but be encouraged today, for you are an advantage. You have the lifetime favor of God in your life. God is in control of your destiny. Your future is full of possibilities. Your circumstances will never overrule God's plans for your life. They will only bow to God's plan. Favor often shows up in hard times, in storms of life. So, in every situation you are in, dear friend, you may be down now, but you are not out. Proverbs 8.35 says, For those who find me find life, and receive favor from the Lord. You cannot allow circumstances to change your mind, be satisfied with Jesus. There are times that your surroundings will want to steal your joy, when you look around, you get depressed and feel distressed. But those are the times when you have to take a stand and say, I live only for Jesus. Because when God places his favor upon you, he offers you something no man can give. You may have failed in the past, but will find great success in God's favor when you hold on to God. God will prosper you in such a way that even your enemies will know that he is with you. Just be satisfied with Jesus and whatever he gives to you. You are growing through those challenges for his favor to be made manifested in your life. Thank him for your brokenness and life lessons. They are preparing you to be able to handle the favor of the Lord that is coming upon you. God is about to show out in your life. He is about to make those things that seem impossible, possible. He is going to show people out there that you belong to Him. God is making you stronger for you to defeat giants. Because God has accepted and approved you, you shall never be put to shame. Now that you have worked hard to please God, you have been faithful. God will dawn His favor on you.